Cheteshwar Pujara, who scored 300s in four tests, has been receiving accolades from all quarters. After former Australian captain Ian Chappell, the latest to join the Pujara fan club is none other than the legendary Sachin Tendulkar. During a promotional event, when Sachin was asked what stood out for him during India's maiden 2-1 test series win in Australia, Tane Ulkar pointed out Pujara's contribution and the stupendous show by the Indian Pacers. I think fantastic. I think uh, the team has done really well. Uh, I think the way the way the brand of cricket that uh, India has been able to produce uh, down under has been magnificent. And uh, talking about inspiring younger generation for sure. For sure uh, you know, we need heroes in life at various stages, you know, whatever age you may be. You, you want heroes in life and without realizing, you end up becoming a hero for the younger generation as well. And that cycle continues. And I think uh, results like these are really, really important. I still remember when I was a 10-year-old and uh, didn't know much about cricket, but I knew that India had won the World Cup. And that's where my journey started. Hopefully, there are many journeys which have started already. And you need these kind of results to inspire them, to make them believe that you can go out and deliver your best and bring laurels to our nation. And that is exactly what the team has done down under. I think uh, more awareness about the diet, their training methods, better fitness, accessibility to uh, any information that they want. I think uh, these factors contribute a lot, not to forget the infrastructure. I think the infrastructure for cricket is really good. Uh, of course, uh, one should be happy but never be satisfied. So we'll, I hope we continue getting better and better as far as uh, uh, the facilities are provided to the players. Uh, but all these things uh, don't happen overnight. I think it, it's, it's a process. It has taken some time. But I, I feel we've got quality fast bowlers. Of course, at the same time, it's not just to do with your you know diet and accessibility to various information, but also the guys are talented. They are really talented. I mean, if I have to name Bumbra, Shami, uh, uh, Ishan, Kuldeep, uh, Ashwin and Jadeja, I think all these guys, uh, Umesh uh, played one test match, but all these guys have chipped in at various points. Uh, and uh, uh, spinners have also chipped in. So it's, it's not just the fast bowlers, but uh, the spinners. But what you also want, that you're a fast bowlers to come and bowl those uh, hostile spells in patches. And that has happened more frequently. It was not just about the new ball game. It was also to do with the old ball and how consistently one kept bowling 140 plus. And I think that is that is something which, uh, you know, it's it's really pleasing to the eye. And uh, I I can comfortably say that we are we are com a competitive attack in any part of the world on any surface. I think we are ready to go and play anywhere in the world and be extremely competitive. I think uh, Pujara has been really outstanding. I think there are a number of, uh, number of statements uh, on Pujara where, uh, which uh, ideally weren't in his favour and uh, kind of undermine his contribution, not knowing that only rain was going to save them. Uh, and and uh, I think, uh, so I would, I would say along with, not to, you know, ignore or undermine the bowlers' contribution. I think the bowlers have done exceedingly well. But I think somewhere Pujara has uh, been uh, instrumental in laying that solid foundation on which there were a number of guys who went out and got runs. Viraj scored runs uh, in the second test, third test, that partnership. Ajinkya had that uh, crucial partnership. Then Rishabh, uh, Jadeja, all these guys have done well. Mayank uh, got off to a good start. But I think if I have to pinpoint one guy, then uh, I think Pujara stands out along with other fast bowlers.